The naked, bullet-riddled bodies of four women were found near the airport of San Salvador today. They were identified as those of three nuns and a lay Catholic worker, all from the United States, who disappeared two days ago. The women were doing social work in the northern province of El Salvador. Hello, this is me, your dear daughter, who is still alive and safe and sound here in El Salvador. I saw this beautiful blonde girl, and somebody next to me kind of whispered and said, that's Dorothy Kazel. Para nosotros fue una alegría en nuestro pueblo porque habían llegado para ayudar. I had a very interesting experience. I worked with one little girl who was blind, and I prepared her for communion classes. So that basically was the routine until the trouble started. Anyone who tried to organize was suspect. They killed people for nothing, for nothing. Ten bodies found in Santa Ana, five in El Chapan, another 12 in San Miguel. None of us thought we, gringos, were in trouble or in danger. Why should religion be such a threat? Did they kill a priest? They can kill anyone. It is impossible that four Americans would be murdered without the sign-off of a very high level of command. This will curl your blood, too. The group that does all the killing all the time, they're right across the street from us, so anytime anything's going on in the church, they certainly can hear and listen to what we're saying, and we're not saying anything bad or communistic like they claim here. Who ordered these killings? Where's Dorothy? Where's Dorothy? Mr. Kazel kept saying, what did my little girl ever do to hurt them? Hold on to this tape for me. I don't want my parents to hear all the detail on it. It's kind of gory in spots. 